Grace from Imago. Um, before I start, I want to. I. 네, 잠시 기다리겠습니다. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Hello, guys. I'm Grace. Um, before before we start, I want to. I have a question. So, how many kids like do you have around you? Like maybe they are your kids, or they are your niece or nephew, or your student. Yeah. If you do, yeah, please listen carefully. This is your. This is the what you need. Yeah, we are the missing platform and app for early childhood education. Yeah, do you know ninety percent of the children's brain development de developed? Before age five, and that, that cause achievement gaps um, before they get to the kindergarten. Who do you think is the mainly mainly responsible responsibility has a responsibility to their achievement, their development, and their education? Yes, first is the parents, and second is the daycare teachers. Yeah, so there are 2.3 million children in Korea, and you, like maybe some, some of you have heard about the report that um, about the children abuse, children abusing happens in a daycare in Korea. Why? Why it happens a lot of time recently? It's because of their teachers' environment. They have to work 9.5, 9.5 hours a day and three minutes break time, and take, and even they have to take work home. That's why they have a 60% of the turnover rate. It's really high. Yeah, we asked the daycare teachers why. What is the most time-consuming task, and why you have to work a lot of time? They said it's because of a lot of paper paperwork. Yeah, they have to spend 20 hours a week for the paper, only for the paperwork. It's because they there's the two main paperwork. One is a, one is a daily class report, and the other one is a daily children report. So they have to make a form in Korea. They have to make a form, and they have to put the curriculum in the form, and they have to make sure their curriculum is matches in their um, in their weekly form and the daily form. Because why they have to do it? Because that's the government guideline. They have to do it. And also, there's the other report. They have to write down every every day for each one of their children. Each, each one of their um, children, and it's really time consuming that, um, according to what they said, and they, it's hard to put every information about the kids, about their health, their education, everything, in a small knot. Yeah, and one of the points that Imago, uh, Imago focused is the one the data that teachers write down um, is untrackable. It's a, it's a such a waste thing because um, there are so many information, informa important information about the children, including social relationships and education. But the problem is they are just wasted, and it's hard to uh, trackable. Yeah, so. The solution the Imago has is the all-in-one classroom management and business tool and parent communication app. So we can reduce their work hour to one hour a day. So how to do that, how it works is that our platform is only the thing teachers are doing is they're they just uh, simply clicking and selecting what activity they want to do in the weekly, and it automatically matched to the daily daily um, report. And they, if they click the publish, it just it 
And if they want to send it to parent, it just goes to the parent automatically, and it's really easy to track. So overtime data is acknowledged to provide the curricular suggestions to teachers and trackable progress to parents. Thank you. All right. yeah, thank you so much. Um, yeah, thank you for the question. <laughs> That's the biggest one, yeah, biggest thing that we miss. So, um, so we charge the daycare thirty uh, thirty dollars per month. This is the amount that they currently pay for their curriculum. Like, um, yeah, this is the amount they're paying. Yeah, to the for the care curriculum. And also, we have the platform, uh, our platform just automatically matches the um, parents because they are, um, they have a communication with the, with the teachers um, through our, yeah, through our platform. So we can charge, we have, we can have the target for the ad, for the advertisement. Uh, I'm, I'm a little confused. You know the service his note? Yes. What's the difference between you and his note? Yeah, that's a good question too. Thank you. So, <laughs> yeah. So, um, we have this, those are our competitors. So, his note, they, um, they are the biggest company that we face. And they actually, they, they are the um, B2C. So they help the they help communicate with teacher between teachers and parents. But the problem is they don't have the curriculum. They don't provide curriculums. But we provide curriculums. And teachers, uh, kids not doesn't help with the reducing task for the um, for daycare teachers. But we help uh, we help the. They can teach us to reduce their work, and also we have a platform like KidsNut, and we got a feedback from the teacher about KidsNut, and we will make, uh, we will more upgrade. Uh, we'll, yeah, we'll upgrade. Did you already developed your product? Um, yes, we almost done with the website, um, but. And then we started, okay, thank you for the question. <laughs> yeah, so um, we, yes, we, we already been made the website and we started the making the app um, last August and we will finish the um, soft launching both website and the app application next January. Okay, thank you very much. Yeah, thank you so much. Thank you.